In this video, I'll walk you through how to configure the Facebook aggregate event measurement for your custom conversions, which allows us to measure and track web events from people who opted into the iOS 14 update. Although we have the option to configure and prioritize eight events for the campaign optimization, this video on the other hand is more like a continuation of the previous where we created a single custom conversion for our campaign optimization. And we're just going to finish the setup process for the aggregate events before starting out creating an ad campaign. So starting from where we stopped, I will just have to click on configure, which will bring us to this page. So I'll just have to open this up and select manage events. That should prompt this pop-up and you can just go through the information in here, giving us a quick brief of what to expect when we make changes to the web event. I'll just click on edit. And now I just need to click on the add events button and we can start out choosing the custom conversion we created earlier. So I'll just click on this section under pixel and custom conversion. And since this video is focused solely on custom conversion, that's what we want to select. In under event name, we want to choose the custom conversion we created earlier, which is named leads for product ABC. Since we created just one custom conversion, that's all we need to configure the events measurement. So with that in mind, I'll just click on apply and that should prompt another pop-up asking us to confirm the update we just made to the events configuration. And the beauty to creating custom conversion is that the update takes effect immediately as compared to when it's been configured using pixels where the entire setup takes about 72 hours, which is three days. Let's affirm to these changes and click on apply. And once that is configured, we can move on to the ads manager to see if we've done everything right before starting out creating an ad campaign. So I can just click on the hamburger menu and then select ads manager. Now from here, I can click on the create button. For the campaign objective, select sales. Let's choose a name for the campaign, ad set and ad creative. And then continue. We don't have much business here since we just want to confirm if we've set everything right with the web event. So I'll just select the ad set level Now this field is what we want to click on. So I can either select pixel or I can click on select from custom conversion. Either way brings us to the same place. So once that is selected, click on this field to select the custom conversion. And here we can see the custom conversion we created earlier, which contains the set of rules that needs to be met for the campaign objective to be met. So with this set, you can carry on creating your ad campaign, which should probably be the next topic discussion. I totally appreciate you for sticking to the end and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.